Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to my year 5 social study classes. So today's presentation, the topic is the buildings of the Brunei empires by Sultan Bolkiah. So before we start our lesson, I'm going to share our learning objective, which is at the end of the lessons, students will be able to study how Sultan Bolkiah ruled Brunei. Students also will be able to study how Sultan Bolkiah solved the problems that Brunei faced during his reign. Our steps to success, the first step is to study Sultan Bolkiah profile. Second is to study how Sultan Bolkiah established Brunei empires. And third, to study how Sultan Bolkiah solved the problem faced by Brunei. Okay, moving on to the next slide. Sultan Bolkiah. Who is Sultan Bolkiah? Sultan Bolkiah is the son of Sultan Suleiman, our fourth Sultan of Brunei. So after Sultan Suleiman resigned, Sultan Bolkiah became the fifth Sultan of Brunei. Since Sultan Bolkiah becomes king of Brunei, Brunei becomes very, very powerful regions that could control the whole of Borneo and some part of Philippines. Brunei also become very peaceful and rich countries because there's a lot of trading going on in Brunei and there's a lot of visitors came to Brunei. So this was the golden age of Brunei because Brunei Empire was at greatest level. So moving on to the next slide on how was the Brunei Empire established under Sultan Bolkiah. Actually there were two challenges faced by Sultan Bolkiah. The first challenge is the unfriendly neighbor. This unfriendly neighbor carry out pirate attacks and raids on Brunei ships and ports. The second challenge is all threat methods. Sultan Bolkiah realized that Brunei had all threat methods, so he wanted new ideas on how to make Brunei rich and successful. So let's see how the Sultan Bolkiah managed to solve the problem faced by Brunei. The first solution, he built new relationship with neighboring countries such as Chinese King, Majapahit Kingdoms, Sulu Kingdoms and he also wanted to make a threat link with Portuguese. The second solution is to conquest. He built up his armies and navy to protect Brunei. So since Brunei had a very strong army and navy, Brunei able to control the whole part of Borneo and some part of the Philippines. So since Brunei is very strong countries, many kingdoms also wanted to be under Brunei protections. The third solution is welcoming foreigners. Sultan Bolkiah welcomed foreigners and many Muslim merchants came to Brunei to trade and these Muslim merchants also shared their experience and trading skills that could benefit Brunei. He also welcomed Europeans to learn from them as well. The first Europeans visitors to Brunei in 1521 was Antonio Figapeta. The fourth solution made by Sultan Bukia, he traveled. He loved to travel and visit the place that he ruled so that he understand his people better and it also provide him new ideas on how to rule Brunei Empire. So in conclusion, to conclude our presentations today, when Brunei was under Sultan Bolkia, Brunei became a very peaceful country and stability because Brunei had a very strong army and navy. Since there's a lot of trading and visitors came into Brunei during Sultan Bolkia reign, Brunei becomes very rich countries. He also uh, strengthened his contact with other countries to get new ideas on how to build up his empire. With a strong army and navy, he also conquests other kingdoms and from this conquest, it's helped 
him to expand Brunei territories. So that's all for today's lessons. Hopefully this video presentations will help you guys to do your homelink pack that that you guys already received. So that's all for me for today. Thank you very much for uh, watching this video presentations.